Now on PBS, for deaf and hard of hearing viewers, there's more to meet the eye. It's called Closed Caption TV. PBS is proud to have pioneered its development because for millions of persons with impaired hearing, closed captioning can open new windows on the world. Here's the way captioning works. The audio portion of the show is turned into visible subtitles or captions. These captions are then recorded, encoded, and transmitted to the home. In the home, an adapter unit attached to the TV allows captions to be shown on the screen, making it easy for hearing impaired persons to follow dialogue and action. Here's an example of a program like seen on a normal TV. Yeah. Yeah. Here's the it same program like seen on a TV with an adapter unit. Yeah. Yeah. Shows already closed captioned on public TV include the continuing series of acclaimed dramas, Masterpiece Theater. The wonders of science are explored each week on Nova, while 3 to one Contact helps children understand how science affects our daily lives. An anthology of suspense thrillers makes Mystery a show that preserves the great tradition of the whodunit. Odyssey is a close-up study of past and present cultures throughout the world. Culture, the economy, and fitness are just some of the subjects discussed on Over Easy, a show addressing the needs and concerns of growing older. While youngsters enjoy a showcase of literary gems on Once Upon a Classic. Captioned programs were first offered on a regular basis on PBS. We are pleased that not only will these programs continue, but that our efforts are being joined by those of commercial broadcasters. Closed caption shows are represented by this symbol. It will appear on TV listings, letting viewers know when they can watch these shows. Closed caption programs for the enjoyment and information of millions who might otherwise only see half the television picture. For further information on captioning, write Captions, Box 23299, Washington, D.C., 20024.